Hello and welcome back to another wonderful week. Um, this week is going to be wonderful. Um, it is the week, um, the twenty third um, week of the year two thousand and eighteen, and the week begins from the fourth until the ten. It's going to be a week of fire. It's going to be a wonderful week. We have the, the energy of the chariot. So. When we have the energy of the chariot, we have the energy of movement, success, victories, and that sort of a thing. Okay, you guys, your birthdays, you Gemini's who were born on, um, you Gemini's were born on um, the um, the fort until. The tent we are going to be looking at you guys so this is your new year this is the year 2018 this is the beginning of your year 2018 okay I need to do a video to let people understand um, what is happening um, whenever you begin your year birthday comes along okay so for the people who was born for the people who was born the fort of um, the fort of uh, June until um, the 10th this is a year year 2018 so happy birthdays to you guys and let's see what is happening because it's gonna be a beautiful year for you guys we have the energy of the world which is fantastic an earth sign and then we have a new journey so some of you and then we have you some of you going to deal with some karmatic situations in this year I don't know what's happening um, for uh, you Gemini's but um, whoever you are you ladies uh, um, between the ages of uh, 25 and 45 be aware um, in this year because um, the energies have fallen out you men um, that were born um, you men over the age of 40 um, beware um, what you're you are doing um, because this year is going to be a very surprising year I'm seeing end of conflicts for a lot of you people if you were going um, through conflicts and that sort of a thing I'm seeing ending of conflicts but ladies between the ages of 25 and um, 45 be aware of what is happening so I'm calling upon the angels and guides and the universal angels of uh, I don't know what is happening <laughs> I don't know what is happening but a cleansing is an alien is coming in for you guys in this year okay so be aware of that okay so without adjourn to all the angels and guides and the universal angels let's see what's happening for the Gemini's um, in this week there is wonderful news um, that is going to be happening the star comes out uh, um this is so wonderful profoundly wonderful what is happening i'm loving these energies okay so a lot of clarities are going to be coming in for you guys a lot of clarities whatever is happening a lot of clarities is going to be coming in um let's see um what is really happening for you gemini's that were born <laughs> oh boy oh boy oh boy oh boy a lot of wonderful changes that are going to be coming in so wonderful surprises um, and I should say a lot of you Gemini's are going to be buying new houses in this year you're going to be moving um, it's all about um, your personal life it's all about where you live where you um, work and that sort of a thing but it's going to be positive um, situation you're going to be seeing um, a, a situation is going to be um, you know very clearly um, whenever it comes on to house I'm seeing a lot of you Gemini's are also going to get married 
a lot of you Gemini's are going to get married some of you are going to be getting divorced I'm seeing wonderful positive energies I'm seeing money coming in for the Gemini's who are going to be born or who were born on the night but let's begin with the energies of the Gemini's who were born on the 4th of June okay we have an energy here that we're dealing with jealousy um, a lot of jealousy is coming at you a lot of jealousy there's a lot of hate and um, it can be coming in from outside for some of you some of you um, be aware of things that you have done in the past because um, it's going to be affecting you now in the future but the outcomes is going to be a fabulous 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 year so what is happening there's a lot of jealousy coming at you and why this is happening it's because you have the energy of the year so whatever situation that has been transpiring in your life you are now going to have positive positive energies coming out because good news is on its way for you and this is going to be a year where profound good things are going to be happening for you whatever transaction whatever you're wishing and open for this year is a year to go forward and do it because you have the energy of the six of ones and this is saying for you guys whatever you decided whatever changes you decided to do from this birthday until next birthday go ahead and do it because everything you ask for will be granted so that is a good good sign okay so we are looking at the people who are born on the 5th of June we have an ending or a transition for some people it's going to be an ending for some people it's going to be a transition okay if your mother is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn this person could be moving on to the spirit world okay so if your mother or father is a as is, is, is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn they could be moving on to the spirit world for the rest of people who have been going through difficulties and uh, um, people who have been you know taking each day at a time and going through there's a transition that is coming for you okay um, some of you are going to have a new beginning with someone who is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn I'm sorry I have to take this call it's my son I'm sorry <laughs> I my son called so yeah okay so whatever the situation is um, they could be passing on or some of you could be um, starting a new relationship with a Pisces Cancer no with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn I'm so sorry okay so um, this is going to be wonderful this is going to be good so not to worry about that okay as we move on to the people who were born on the six there is going to be marriage a positive good marriage this is good for new contracts dream jobs coming in wonderful positive um, connection with people situation and organization this is going to be an extremely good positive positive situation that is happening okay so um, you're going to be finding yourself con connecting with a lot of people in this and 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 whatever if, if you're looking for a new job if you're looking um, to connect in a group or that sort of a situation for a lot of people you're going to also be getting married and this marriage was orchestrated by um, positive energies from your guiding angels and your uh, from not only your guiding angels but also from your um, your soulmate guiding angels because this is marriage this is marriage it's not an accent it's not a question but this is marriage this is marriage the energy of the ring is marriage and it's also contract so some people will be receiving their dream jobs in this year if you're studying and it's the end and it's your last year it's going to be a very very positive um, st study a very very positive end um, it's going to be extremely extremely good okay 
um so we're moving forward and we are going to be looking at the energies for the people who were born on the seventh um, a lot of you have to make choices you have come to the end of the road and you have to make some choices in your life in this year so whatever the choices are going to be whether it's in relationship whether it's in work whether it's in um, moving whether it's in going forward with your life with a relationship or not or um, whatever the choice is, is it's going to be about relationship friendships it's all about relationships and friendships it's about intimate relationships it's about meeting your twin flame and soulmate in this year and have the discipline to go through with them to go the fur the, the the length of uh, through all the things that you have to do it's all about choices okay then it's about discipline it's about discipline being um, true to yourself but also let the other person being true to their self too and this is going to be good and positive so whatever the situation is it's going to be a positive year it's going to be a lovely year it's going to be a beautiful year because there are positive energies coming in I'm seeing a lot of you who are meeting soulmates and twin flame you're going to be deciding to um, go and live with them and connect with them and this is going to be good because it's going to be bringing positive situations some of you are going to be realizing that you have been with someone for a very long time and this is your soulmate or twin flame a lot of invitations are coming for a lot of people a lot of wonderful invitations are coming for a lot of people um, and these are going to be positive positive energies positive situations that are coming for a lot of people and with this situation what you're going to be seeing happening is that um, a lot of invitation but yet still um, it is the end of whatever that was blocking um, situations to flow in your life um, if you had been dealing with certain obstacles in your life you are going to be overcoming these obstacles and if you were having a lawsuit or something that of a, um, you know disadvantage some disadvantage that was taken of you whatever um, that was happening to you you are going to be overcoming this thing in a positive positive way so whatever that has been happening whatever that has been transpiring you are going to be realizing that this is going to be happening in wonderful positive way and this is going to be good okay so here we are again then we're moving forward and we're moving forward for the people who were born on the ninth this is a very beautiful beautiful energy um, it is the energy of infinity abundance the number eight energy that you'll be working with money is going to be coming to you if your financial situation was blocked in the past um, information is coming that you're going to be receiving a lot of money okay so this year is going to bring you at um, a, um, um, a very promotions um, unexpected money um, windfall of money will be coming and this is going to be positive so in um, information is going to be coming at you to let you know now for the people who were born on the 10th it is going to be a, a year of a lot of surprises a lot of unexpected surprises but good surprises okay these unexpected surprises are very positive and very good because what is happening here is that you are going to be um, seeing that whatever the situation is uh, positive this is going to be a year of uh, um, inner knowledge wisdom understanding but in a very 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 positive positive way okay so whatever has happened in your life before whatever that has transpired you are going to be having um, inner wisdom and guidance as to how you are going to be moving forward so again um, I have to advise the ladies because you're in the reverse form the ladies between the ages of 25 and 45 be aware of um, your action in this year um, and um, being in the reverse form meaning that you're working from out your ego base this is not a place to be working out this is um, a place where you need to find inner wisdom and knowledge so use this year to find inner wisdom and knowledge 
whatever the conflicts that you laid is between the ages of 25 and 45 has been going through in the past it's going to now come to an end there is a situation that is happening for you men over the age of 40 you men over the age of 40 if you have been having a misunderstanding with an a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn you need to be aware in this um, year because the energy of the tower comes and the energy of the tower means that there is an healing that is coming for this situation so whatever that was happening whatever that was transpiring whatever that has affected your life in the past there is now coming a positive end to this um ladies and gentlemen i want to explain to you that um each time your birthday changes um, no no one except the people who were born um between the first of january at least the people who were born in the month of January they are the only one that begins the new year in the month of January okay for the rest of the people it's always after your birthday so you have now finished the year 2017 thank God for some of you and now you're moving on to the year 2018 so congratulations and um, the wheel of fortune is also here a lot of clarities a lot of you will be having clarities and that sort of a situation and it's going to be in a positive way so I want to say happy birthday to you guys money success is going to be um, good news money success is going to be um, and, and a lot of people I'm seeing a lot of people buying these looks apartment I'm seeing a lot of people balancing out their financial situation I'm seeing a lot of general Ge Gemini's becoming very um, rich in the year 2018 so success with that namaste until next time